Hello, my name is Ryan Chapman with Fix Your Funnel, and today we're going to be talking about the power of SMS or mobile marketing. Now, you've heard the power of surveys, but what if you could survey new prospects as well as customers to gather info that could help you provide what they want, discover their hot buttons, and allow real engagement? Join me for the next few minutes as I show you exactly how to set this up and deploy it in less than 10 minutes. And nobody gives you this kind of power. I know you've heard the stats before. That currently, 103% of the U.S. population has a cell phone. You heard me right, 103%. So I know that doesn't mean that every man, woman, and child has a cell phone, but some have two or three phone lines. But that's, that's the kind of saturation the market has with cell phones right now. You know that you have to be doing something with cell phones, incorporating them into what you're doing with your marketing. What you may not know is that recent surveys show that 67% of adults now prefer texting as a form of communication over phone calls. Now, I'm not going to get into the why that is the case, but some say that it's because the younger generation prefers texting in the 90% range, and so their parents have discovered that they have to text to stay in touch. So this has driven texting to be the preferred method for interaction on the phone. This is a device that was designed originally to allow for voice conversations. I know, it's crazy. But one thing I know is don't argue with the facts. Use them to reach your goals. A couple of years ago, I was really intrigued with the idea that I could capture leads using texting. So I decided to run a very costly experiment. I paid $5,000 to have a booth at a convention, and it was a relatively tech-savvy group of entrepreneurs, and I decided to use texting exclusively as my means of generating leads. Now, I had the opportunity to talk to one group at the convention for about 10 minutes and then ask them to text a keyword followed by their first name and email address to a six-digit short code. I was able to show a slide that illustrated exactly what to do. It showed a little phone up there with what they should type in. I had a little sample of like my first name and my email address so they could get the concept. And I saw the audience get out their phones and attempt to follow my instructions. And I was amazed at two things. First, short codes, five or six digit numbers, didn't make sense to most of the audience. They were familiar with regular phone numbers, but something's just wrong about a six digit number or a five digit number. And I had more than a few come up to me and ask me for the rest of the phone number. Now bear in mind, this is a convention that was using the exact same six digit short code during the entire convention to give away prizes and broadcast announcements. So it wasn't like this was a foreign concept that just sprung on them. The second big challenge was asking a group to do more than one task at a time. Believe it or not, asking them to enter a keyword then their own first name, then their email address, turned out to be too confusing for many in the room. I received a number of texts with my sample first name and email address in them. Now, I knew the folks in the audience were not morons, although at first I was pulling out my hair thinking that they must be. So why was this so hard? Well, quite simply, we're not wired to follow complicated instructions that are introduced to us as quickly as a marketing message comes at us. So if all of what I shared with you is accurate, then how is anyone making money with SMS marketing? Well, the answer is most have settled. So they've settled by creating a one-dimensional list. They've settled by capturing only those who get short codes. And they've been told that a sell list is better than a sell plus an email list. So they've been told that there's no need for integration with the CRM. So because of all this, they've really just settled, and they've done the best they can with what they have. And even the best SMS solutions currently out there, and we've developed one of them, do not allow for more than a single dimension broadcast or a single shot lead capture. The great news I have for you today is that you don't have to settle, and you can have your cake and eat it too. The reason being is that as of this very moment, you can create any interaction you can imagine using Fix Your Funnel's proprietary SMS conversations tied so closely to Infusionsoft, you'd think it was its sidekick, like Batman's Robin. It should never be separated. So allow me to demonstrate. Let's say you have a simulated live or a live webinar going, and you want to gauge the interest of the attendees. So you ask them to participate in the survey, the results of which you will reveal after the webinar. You ask them to text the word survey to 760-621-8199. When they do, they receive a response back from what appears to be a real person. Hi, this is Ryan. Thanks for participating in the survey. Reply with the letter that corresponds with the answer to the question you see now, i.e. A, B, C, or D. The attendee, now a participant in the presentation, replies back with a response. B. Suddenly, they get a response related to their selection. B, eh? Okay, good deal. What caused you to choose B? They respond back with the reason why. I just hate the way I feel when my offer is rejected. They get a text back saying, I understand. Thanks for participating. Would you like me to send you the resources I mentioned in the webinar? Reply with your email address only, and I'll send it out to you right now. The participant replies with their email address, and the next thing you know, you've sent them the email with the resources. 
wow, they think, this guy really is on top of things. Let's take a quick look at how this was done and what happened in the background that will help you. First, when they texted in the keyword survey, fix your funnel search through Infusionsoft to see if the cell number was already in there. If it was, then a tag was applied to the contact record. If the number didn't exist, a new record was created and a lead source was applied consisting of the number they texted to and the keyword used. Then a response was sent back. This response could have had any field from the contact record merged into it. In our scenario, since this webinar was new prospects, we didn't assume any data not collected in the process would be available. Next, we created a conversation with each of the possible answers. Each of these utilizes a keyword. This was another real limitation I experienced with the short code. See, I had to share the short code with every other company using that short code. So if I wanted the keyword survey, there would have been a really good chance I couldn't get it. I remember requesting keywords on a short code and only two of the 10 I requested were available. Words like sale, promo, offer, special, new, discount, home were all used. I was out of luck. With Fix Your Funnel, you'll never have that problem. Why? Because you can choose any of over 750,000 words in the English language, just for starters. You can use other languages as well. And if you want to use the same keyword in two different ways, you can simply pick up another phone number. Since keywords are no longer a limitation, I can create them without a thought. So that's what I did here. I created four conversations with each initiated by a single letter keyword to keep it simple for the participant. Because I create a separate conversation with each answer, I can now dig deeper on each answer. When they first answer my question, I can tag the answer to conduct my survey and segment the contact in Infusionsoft. But then I can ask more probing questions to discover data that in the past I'd be out of luck to collect. See, each incoming SMS can be stored in a contact field, either a standard Infusionsoft contact field or a custom field. Imagine that a webinar participant doesn't buy. Oh, and I'm requiring cell number and email address in my order form to make sure that the data stays together. When I have a member of my staff make a follow-up call, guess what they have? That's right, the participant's answer to the probing question following up their answer to the multiple choice survey. I wonder if that might help my staff to guide the prospect to the best decision for them. And did you notice, I even collected an email address and that I was able to deliver the promised bait that caused the participant to trust me with their email address without lifting a finger. That's because each step of a conversation can initiate an Infusionsoft follow-up sequence in addition to applying a tag. That means that I can assign a task to a staff member, fulfill on a promise to deliver an email, direct mail, etc. Are you beginning to realize the power of SMS when you have these kinds of options? What could you do now to begin building a sell list in your Infusionsoft database? What will you do now that you don't have to settle for a less robust solution to fulfill your marketing plans? I scoured over the internet for all the ways that folks suggested using SMS to build a business. I've compiled them into a PDF I'd like to email you. To get it now, text the keyword SMS to 760-621-8199. I'll let you guess how I'll get the report to you now that you know my secrets. I discovered over 21 ways that you can use SMS in your marketing, but now you'll be able to take SMS and mobile marketing to new heights since most of these 21 were accomplished with the severe limitations of one dimension blast or incoming SMS, lack of a robust CRM tied into the SMS, awkward short codes, and severely limited and expensive keyword options. Short code operators charge from $5 to $20 per month per keyword. Now you have new rules to play by, rules that will allow you to truly tap into the real power of mobile marketing. To get started now, click the link below this video. If you haven't already, text the keyword SMS to 760-621-8199, and I'll send you this special report with 21 ways you can be using SMS 